the opposite of love isn't hate, it's indifference. And, you know, I can tell when someone still needs healing and is hurt by a situation, when they're still negatively feeling some type of way about the other person. Um, you're projecting your hurt, okay? You're giving this person power over your healing. You're giving this person power over moving on. Every time someone brings up a friend that I don't no longer talk to or an ex, I just, you know, I wish them healing. I wish them the best. I don't sit there and, like, talk about them. You know, I, I wish that, you know, they're happy with the choices and decisions that they've made. But you're give again, you're giving that person power, okay, over your hurt, your projecting, okay? I can't tell you how many times I see in my comments, this is why I don't really like posting tarot readings like that, because every time I post about something, it could even be about somebody new, and people, their people's egos just go straight to their ex, or someone that have that has hurt them. And I'm just like, you do know tarot works and what's current and what's coming, not the past. <laughs> so, you know, unless the reading is about someone throwing witchcraft on you, or like I literally specify that it's an ex, it's not about an ex. <laughs> like, you know, you also. You're, you're placing all this blame on that other person. They might have done some crazy stuff to you, but you also got to think about what did you contribute that ultimately ended in that demise? You chose the person, okay? That's one. Two, you what red flags did you ignore? Because the red flags are always going to show. They, they may be subtle, very indirect, but they show. And you either choose to sweep them under the rug or completely ignore them at the moment. But you you can't 100% say, oh, I didn't see this coming from that person. Because intuitively and in your gut, you knew what it was with this person or that person. So just choose to move on, okay? This is the first step in emotional intelligence. And even if they're talking about you, that's on them. That They still need to heal, right? Even if they feel like you were the bad guy. You don't, at, at, at what point do you stop caring about other people's validation? At what point do you, do you like... Feel good about yourself within yourself and understand your own truth. Move on and heal because that's how the energy is still tied to you. Forgiveness is the key to self-love. 